The David Dunlop Observatory is a large astronomical observatory site located at Young Street and Hillsview Drive in Richmond Hill. The observatory is notable for housing the largest optical telescope in Canada. When it was first built in 1935, the telescope was the second largest in the world with a primary mirror measuring 74 inches in diameter. The observatory was the vision of Clarence Chant, who was a University of Toronto astronomy professor and a member of the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada. Chant dreamt of a world-class observatory for Canada. In hopes of funding the project, Chant looked to a successful Canadian mining executive named David Dunlap. Dunlap showed a keen interest in astronomy, but passed away before he could commit financially. As a memorial to her late husband, Jessie Donalda Dunlap donated the funds to build the observatory site. The observatory officially opened in May 1935 under the ownership of the University of Toronto. The cost was an astonishing $250,000, which is the present-day equivalent of $4,500,000. A notable astronomy professor named Dr. Helen S. Hogg has been associated with the observatory almost from the day it opened. Perhaps best known for her pioneering research in globular clusters, she was also the first woman to be elected president of the Royal Canadian Institute and is also a past president of the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada. Helen's career with the observatory spanned over 60 years until her death in 1993. The observatory has been the site of a number of important studies, including the first confirmation of the existence of a black hole, which was discovered by Dr. Tom Bolton in 1972. Today, astronomy lovers can enjoy public programs for all ages throughout the year, such as Star Talk and Family Night. Now under the stewardship of the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada Toronto Centre, the David Dunlap Observatory continues to promote science, literacy, and a better understanding of our universe.